Okay, now we're going to show you guys how to uh, open and serve a bottle of wine. Uh, first thing to remember is uh, all bars are going to have different size uh, sizes of serve for the wine. So this particular bar, we do a 175ml serve, a 250ml serve, or of course a whole bottle if people want a whole bottle. Um, it's important to know what size uh, your bars have, again for a responsible service of alcohol so you know how many standard drinks customers are having. Um, and of course it's always important to ask the customer uh, what size they'd like when they order. So if they order a glass of wine, you know, is it going to be a small one or a large one? Okay, so uh, the first thing you want to do, when you start, make sure you have a really nice, clean, polished glass. Don't want to be serving wine to a customer in a glass that's got fingerprints or anything like that on it. So here we have a nice, clean, polished glass that I prepared earlier. And a bottle of wine. First thing you want to do, present the wine to the customer so they can see exactly what they're ordering, check that the date's the same, and so forth. And uh, first thing we're going to do is cut the foil off the top. And now we're going to remove the cork. Once we've got the cork out of a fresh bottle, it's important to give the customer a taste of the wine uh, so they can check that it's not corked, that is that uh, uh, oxygen hasn't entered the bottle and uh, oxidised the wine. So we pour them a small taste to start with. Always pour with the label of the bottle facing towards the customer, it's just uh, good uh, pouring. And there we go, so the customer will swirl it around, uh, take a taste and indicate that the wine is not corked and then we can top it up for them. If we're pouring them a, uh, just a uh, glass of wine, rather than if they're ordering a bottle, you're going to take the measure, fill the measure with wine until it's just underneath the top of the uh, wine measure, and pour into the glass like so, and there you have a small glass of red wine. Of course, if you're uh, serving white wine, it's important to make sure you take a wine from the fridge that is properly chilled and not one that's just been placed in there and uh, always serve it with an ice bucket as well so the customers can keep their wine cold. And uh, that's it, a serving glass of wine.